I, I really worry about the future of the Olympic Peninsula if all of our jobs are minimum wage. Because where do our workers w live with housing prices what they are? You know, what's their quality of life? And I want to make sure that I know that there's an economic opportunity for everyone. A recompete is a federal grant process that started with an initial 520 communities across the United States who put in proposals saying, we think you should invest federal dollars in our community. Our goal with Recompete is really to solve big economic problems on the peninsula. We could have chosen just one county, we could have chosen a specific part of that county. What we did was we chose the entire North Olympic Peninsula, which is Kalama and Jefferson counties. Kalama and Jefferson County proposal is one of 22 or 24 that were asked to go to the second round. So, you know, a huge effort already been made to get to this point. We did a lot of research as part of our recompete uh, effort, and one of the things that we found is demographically, in the prime age employment gap, which is that 26 to 54 year old uh, time frame, we lag behind the national average by about 10 points, which translates to about 2,700 individuals between Clallam and Jefferson County. With the funding that Clallam and Jefferson County receives from the federal government through the recompete process, we will have millions of dollars to invest in people, which is essential to the economic engine of our region. And not invest in people, but invest in their skills and work with employers and invent ways to enhance their businesses and their product development and marketing development that allow them to hire even more people, thereby revitalizing the economic engine of the North Olympic Peninsula. It really is about our people and you know, we're, we've been talking a little bit about kind of some of the innovations that we see happening and the investments that we want to make to spur job growth. But a good chunk of what a recompete plan should do is to identify what resources, what human resources you have and what they need to come up to the level where they have marketable job skills and they can be really quickly integrated into that job market. We've got to work collectively to address these issues on the lower wages in certain places, the people who have been marginalized and how do we bring them back in, the different training expectations that employers have. Where there's a business that's good for the business, where it can it has a product that that is valuable in the market, where it's good for our community, where we will it will not degrade our natural resources, it will not degrade the place that we live, and it's good for the environment. You know, it's creating good jobs and it's not despoiling our resources. And those are the kind of industries that we've really targeted. What this has shown me is the peninsula is worth investing in. For the, the community members that are looking at some of these jobs going, I don't have that, I don't have that skill, I don't have this, I want to do that. This is the chance to do that. This is a chance to have the funding to do that, to say, this is your chance. And with that chance and that opportunity, if taken and realized, you have a path forward that might not have been there before. That's a powerful change.